against cruelty, and a global fight for sustainability. Global animal welfare laws are in order, and we will not stop until change happens. Now, the the nonprofit group No Dogs Left Behind is on a mission to save the countless number of dogs from the illegal dog meat trade in Asia. Once rescued, they are brought to a sanctuary where they receive the care they need and then eventually on a journey to find their forever homes. Joining us now to tell us more, the founder of No Dogs Left Behind, Jeffrey Baer. Jeffrey, good morning. Good morning to you. We appreciate you joining us, reading about your organization, uh, just unbelievable. Tell us about how everything works logistically. Well, thank you very much for inviting me. No Dogs Left Behind fights to fight in the front lines. We fight in some of the harshest places in the world. Uh, our macro sense is to fight for global animal welfare laws. We're fighting to end what's called the dog meat trade in East Asia. Um, we fight with brave, very brave activists and volunteers across East Asia. And essentially, we, we fight, uh, we surround uh, slaughter, slaughter trucks. We demand the release of of, of the, 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 the dogs from slaughter trucks. We demand that they provide proof of, of the dogs and their health certificates, which they normally can't provide. Uh, we do the same thing with slaughterhouses. And, and uh, once they can't provide the, the documentation, we call in government officials, we call in the press and the media, and we, we continue to provide pressure on governments that they, they enforce global animal welfare laws to protect people and also to protect the, the animals themselves. Uh, global animal welfare laws are in order, and until that happens, we'll continue to put the pressure on governments all over the world. How is it that you're able to get into, like, maybe some of these wet markets uh, in China or if there's other restrictive governments? How are, how are you able to accomplish anything there? Uh, do, you, do, you, do your workers some, or do your people sometimes get arrested? We have, we are, it's very strategic. Um, yes, it's very dangerous. We, uh, you know, the work that we do is extremely dangerous and our lives are constantly at risk uh, in East Asia or whether it be in Afghanistan. Uh, we, we were um, on the front lines in Afghanistan and we were the ones that um, um, flew into Afghanistan and brought back 300 survivors that were left behind. Um, so what we do is, uh, we work, again, we work with brave activists and volunteers and we strategically go in and we work together um, along with government officials as well. And, you know, it's, it, there's a fine line. And, um, you know, so, so, you know, working together um, collectively for change is important. Jeffrey, where are the most difficult countries to get dogs out of? Uh, well, you know, in general, it's been complicated in a macro sense. You know, the, the CDC has banned the importation in America, and now they've opened up the borders to, to let the dogs in. Canada has now banned the importation of dogs um, to, to, to um, you know, to, to, to bring the dogs into Canada. Um, the, you know, all the tensions are high in, in, from, for, uh, with respect to the relationships from China and, and America. So it's really been complicated for rescues like No Dogs Left Behind. Uh, but we, we, we're not going to stop. We're resilient. Um, we're going to continue to fight for the voiceless. We're going to continue to fight to put pressure on governments all over the world, demanding that animal welfare laws are in order. Can you imagine that countries have no animal welfare laws? in the 21st century. It's the 21st century and changes in, in order. Jeffrey, there are any of these... No country... I'm sorry to yes. interrupt you, we're short on time. Are any of the dogs available for adoption? Yes, we do have dogs available for adoption in Canada. Please contact No Dogs Left Behind um, for volunteering, for adoption, for foster. Gotcha. Uh, log on to nodogsleftbehind.com. All right, Jeffrey, thanks so much. Here's the information right. there on your screen. Again, Jeffrey, thank you so much.